I wish my teeth were this bright. Hi, it's Divya G. Or is it? Que significa que? Gripping. Had me on the edge. Dan Brown is I'm quaking. literally so oh my scared God, right now. New York Times best-selling novel, number one. Or does it? Today I will show you how you can create your own generic thriller mystery novel. The type your mom would buy at the airport. It's almost as generic as me. Yes, like DJ Khaled's most poignant statement. Another one. It's close to midnight. Casual Saturday evening and here I am. Doing the usual, you know, just casually talking to myself. <laughs> Banter. I won't lie, I don't read many thrillers, okay? I, I barely read in general, um, but I've read a grand total of one. And that was Gone Girl, so I don't even know if that counts. But that doesn't stop me from having eyes. In terms of color scheme, you want blacks, whites, blues, and reds. They're your best bet for creating, you know, that foreboding atmosphere. That's right, guys. I didn't get that A star in English A level for just no reason. For the main background, you have a few options. You can either have an extreme close up of an object, it could be anything your heart desires, such as, you know, the door handle or the edge of a knife glinting under the moonlight or the string of a tampon. Because it's about to get bloody. Ha 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 ha. <laughs> but no mystery thriller is complete without the silhouette of a man in a trench coat with a hat. But if you really want something evil lurking in the dark, Kim Jong-un. Uh, who can forget, you need the babe magnet fedora hats for the depressed genius alcoholic Sherlock type detective. I mean, who even is, you know, beetroot cumin snatch? I uh, don't know him. You're all alone in your room and you hear the door slam Realize there's nowhere left to run. Like any sane person, instead of calling the police, you go and investigate because you have a death wish and otherwise there is no plot. But what's behind the door? The toilet? The minion? The dead ex-wife who knew too much? Narnia? So we want to get a little bit dark and a little bit shadowy, you know, just to get all the girls going, oh my god, who is he? Who is he? It's a mystery. Um, for the title, you want to be vague, but also kind of literal at the same time. So, you know, the girl on the train, the boy in the suitcase, and you can't go wrong with a little sprinkle um, of death. Anchored by death, breath of death, a sip of death, just, just lovely, just death. But I think we're gonna call ours the thing because this is killer, thriller, chiller. And like any good books, you want to draw your readers in, telling them that your favorite author has read this book too. And we're going to caption it, made me shit my pants. Because if it doesn't make you shit your pants, is it really a thriller? <laughs> Wow. 
Will I make another video? Who knows? It's all a mystery. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. Oh, wow. Congratulations. You've reached the end of my video. You win a big golden sticker. Turn on notifications and subscribe because I don't really upload anyway. Um, so make sure you'll never miss another Divya video um, ever again because who, who wants to do that? <laughs> miss this beautiful face. <clears throat> that, uh, <laughs> Next time I'll make a how to create your own horror uh, novel. Um, step one, um, copy my face. Step two, put my face on the cover. <laughs> I'm scared. Um, and unlike the mystery thriller novels, the only time you're allowed to follow me is on Twitter um, and also on Instagram. Another plug. Um, peace out. Alright. <laughs> oh, oh, mocking Jay. Oh, yeah, no. Boop. I have university exams coming up, so my last um, Vine recreation compilation <coughs> plug 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 plug, <coughs> plug. Um, and this video will have to do for now. Oh, sorry about that cough. I have hay fever. So if you have any vines that you would like me to recreate that I haven't already, um, let me know, you know, hit me up, you know, send a hitman my way. Boop. I'm not here trying to look like a saturated pad. Why is it so bright? Boop. Or is it? Am I emo? Boop. My mom told me it's rude to stare, so don't stare at the sun, you'll damage your vision. I mean, when I think about it, I already damage my vision every day in the morning when I look at myself in the mirror anyway, so really, what is the difference? Um, okay, <laughs> relatable when you're ugly. Take a trip into my garden, I've got some else to show ya. What garden, Troy? What garden?